Today we're making super delicious chicken burrito bowls. I love a burrito bowl. I love a chicken burrito bowl. Uh, look, I love any kind of bowl that has rice and beans and a protein in it. Today, chicken burrito bowls are delicious. And we start by making this really good cilantro rice. Here we go. And before anybody complains about me having a dog in my arms and then I'm gonna cook, it's not a restaurant, it's my house. I'm okay with it. <laughs> if it was a restaurant, I wouldn't have a dog. And if it bothers you, oh, by the way, I'm also on bare feet. <laughs> so <both> are. <laughs> I'm breaking a ton of rules, but it's my house. <laughs> uh, in the bowl of a rice cooker, we put a cup of rice and then we rinse it. And rinsing will get the unwanted extra starch off. You see the water starting to get sort of white and milky. That's what we don't really want. So the water goes in and then with our hand, we just mi mix it around, give it a little squeeze and we pour off the water much as you can without starting to lose a whole bunch of rice. And at this point, we could add water to cook it, but we're going to add chicken broth, just a little extra flavor. So in it goes. So the goal is you put the broth in, you put the water in, whatever you're using to cook your rice. You flatten the rice out across the bottom, and then you take your finger and you put it in, and you want your finger to touch the top of the rice, and the liquid should come to there. This will give you Perfect rice every time, like this. So it goes in, right there. Touching rice, touching rice. Do it in a couple spots, it's perfect. Put it in our rice cooker. At this point, perfect liquid amount in there. We're gonna add a pinch of salt, a little cumin, a quarter teaspoon. Give it a stir, and then you just plug it in, like this. Hit start, and let it go. Rice is done, right? Here's what it looks like. But more importantly is what it smells like, which is that gent steamed up, that gentle little level of cumin that we added to it. So good. Now we add two other things. We add some cilantro, and not an insignificant amount, and the juice of a lime. The smell is amazing, amazing. Oh my gosh, cilantro lime, oh oh. All right, so this, Clearly just black beans, right? I've done nothing to them but drain them. I'm gonna add a little cumin and a little garlic powder. Mix and just keep warm. We have three main components. We have the rice, we have the beans, and we have the chicken that I haven't cooked yet. So here's my wok, it's heating. It goes a little neutral oil. And then a chicken thigh, it's about a half a pound, that I've cut up. And so just as we start to do this, make sure it's all separated. This is gonna be enough for two, what we're making here. So this won't take long, you want a super hot pan. And then here's what it gets. It gets a little chipotle chili powder and more cumin and a little more garlic powder. A squeeze of oil and away we go. And as that starts to finish, we can build our bowl. First, we'll put in some rice, some of the beans, chicken, diced avocado, gorgeous, some tomato, some green onion, and a little bit more cilantro. Oh, that is a chicken burrito bowl, whatever you want to call it. And something this gorgeous requires you try the independent pieces. So a little rice. Wow. Amazing by itself. The beans. So good. My usual thing to do with beans, a little cumin, some garlic, a bite of the chicken. Moist, delicious. You could use a breast, but and then a little bit of everything with some of the avo and tomato and on top. Mm. Delicious, really flavorful, really flavorful. Healthy, I don't know where the bat is in this. Oh wait, there is none. It's just straight delicious. Make this. It's really good, it's really good. Tell your friends about us, follow me on uh, 
Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter. Thanks for hanging out.